Hello my friends, this is EdTech with Adam, and today I'm going to show you how to fix a bug that's happening right now in Kami app uh, regarding our voice or video annotation functions. So this is something that I came across when I was testing Kami app for one of my latest videos and I had to look around for solutions and couldn't find one but managed to find the solution by myself. So how we encounter this bug first of all is when you go into do an annotation you go into comments and we're going to try to make a audio comment, a voice comment here. So we'll highlight this and we get an error message saying audio commenting is not supported in your browser. And if we try the video comment we also get a similar error so you see here, we just got this pop-up that says, please use Chrome or Firefox for recording video comments. Video recording is not supported in your browser. And I am actually using uh, Chrome, the latest upgraded version of Chrome as well. And so I know clearly that these two bugs, these two errors are not happening because of my browser. So there must be another cause of this. And what I've found is actually the cause is in your microphone settings. So this is mostly for Windows 10 users. Uh, we have a Windows 10 microphone privacy setting and if you go into your search bar and you type in microphone privacy settings and you go into that you'll see here that there is an option to turn on and off your microphone for privacy and if your microphone is turned off it will not allow you to access it in Kami app. So I'm going to turn that on and go back into Kami app. And now let's try that again. I'm going back up to the voice comment and let's see if this works here. Testing, testing, here's my voice comment, testing, testing. And let's see if it works. Testing, testing, here's my voice comment, testing, testing. Excellent. And so then now we know that that works. What about the video comment? Now this one works as well. Uh, now, because I'm using a recording program on my computer at the same time, I won't be able to show this uh, synchronously, but I'm going to do one after I turn off the camera or the video here, and then I'll be able to show it to you. Okay, so I've gone ahead and recorded that, and you can see my camera right in front of me here. Testing, testing, here's my camera, testing, testing. Right, and so now both of these work. And again, it's all about enabling your microphone privacy settings so that other apps and other things can use them. So if this was an issue that you came across, hopefully this is your solution. If you have another issue you came across, let me know and maybe I can investigate it and see if I can find a workaround or another solution for it. All right, that's it for today. I hope you all enjoyed that and it was helpful. Please remember to like and subscribe and let me know in the comments what you'd like to know, what kind of apps you'd like to see me try or what kind of jobs you're trying to do in your class that I might be able to find a solution for for you. All right, everyone stay healthy and safe. Bye-bye.